Hello, and welcome to an installment of Geology in the Face, where we look at geology with our faces. So today we are in Hawking Hills, a little slice of my heart in Ohio. What you see here is Rock House, and like the name implies, it is a house made of rock, specifically the Blackhand Sandstone. Native Americans used to call this place home, and you can see remnants of their lives, like the ovens they used. Imagine baking bread. Now imagine a dead pigeon, because that's what I found. Now, you might ask, did the Native Americans carve Rock House? No. The force that sustained the Native Americans is the same force that carved this structure water. Water trickled through cracks in the rock like the horizontal joint you see here in the roof which is made up of more resistant sandstone. Slowly water eroded away the less resistant layer beneath. The shape of the cave which has a cylindrical bottom may indicate that water had been collecting here like an underground pond. Water continued to travel along cracks to form the windows we see we can see evidence of this process continuing in the form of calcium deposits and water streaks. Thank you, and this has been Geology in the Face.